Hello buddy, my name is Missing and welcome to Let's Play Not Everything is Flammable by developer D-A-M or Dam, you know, however you want to go about it. Uh, and after the menu we've got music, sound credits, and here are those, if you want to look at those. And I, there's a lot of people look like I worked on this game. Much more people than I do. When I'm at games, it's just me, you know, staying alone, hanging out in my room by myself. That's fine. Uh, let's go check it out. I wish everything was flammable, honestly. Let's try to play it out, see how it goes. Uh, we're gonna use our keys. And, um, yeah, let's try it out. So it looks like we're actually the fire. I'm gonna burn stuff down. Oh no, we're knocking stuff down. Do we have to burn everything down? I am totally down for that. Burning everything in my path? That sounds fantastic. I would travel by the fire. Oh no, my light's getting dimmer. Okay, so we gotta keep the fire lit. So if we burn out, I guess we die. Let's not do that. October 14th. More like October burned into the air. Okay. So yeah, this is made in the Unity engine using the use of the 2D things, which is fantastic. I'm a big fan of the Unity engine. It's what I use when I do stuff. If I ever do stuff. Besides, sit at home and watch YouTube. Which you should do more often. This is a good place. I think so. Oh, I found the water. Oh, that's embarrassing. Okay, well it looks like there isn't any sand on this game, which is unfortunate. I might have to see if I can put some kind of background free royalty music in there so you guys don't get bored. But um, yeah, the point of the game is to keep yourself uh, alive in fire and don't drink the water, which I did stupidly. It's my fault, being all dumb and stuff. My specialty, I died. I'm really bad at this game. Um. Maybe we should look at the UI on this. We're making money. Or maybe that's like the amount of insurance damage we're causing. Which is okay. That's a lot of money for books. If you're paying that much money for books, stop reading. Honestly. <laughs> like, it's not worth it. I wouldn't... I don't read anyway. The clock? J jump over the fire, the water death thing. That's what we're now hanging out with. There's a bra. Turn that down to the ground. Turn the guitar. Guitar bra. There's a balloon. We'll fly up in the air. Oh my gosh. Oh, we don't want to die. That's another balloon. I guess we're traversing across. This is epic. Oh, what is that? A tinder? Tur turtle? Tur bush thing? It's a lawnmower, a garden gnome. That's awesome. We could. Let's see, roll over, burn that thing down. I guess I'm stuck in the tree. Oh, well, we gotta go. Nope, we're dead. That's the end of it. I don't know how to tell you. Um, cool things about this game. I think they made a very good use of a pixelated style in 2D. U using the Unity engine, um, 2D has gotten a lot more better. It's better for mobile games and stuff. It's fantastic. But even with the particle effects, they still did a really good job using pixel kind of things. And I'm totally down for that. Burn and stuff. What, I mean, what is that? It looks like an iron, but iron... Oh, crap. I'm going to die. Oh, no. Oh, I just fell into the freaking fishbowl. What is with that? Fishbowl's on the ground. It's a dumb idea anyway. Why well, I can't burn the couch? Not, you know, not everything is flammable. Um, you can jump in the air to double jump. Okay. That's... I knew that. Okay, I'm not that stupid. I gotcha. Um, I don't know what to say much more about the game, except that it's it's kind of addicting, actually. I mean... Like, I'm really bad at it myself. And I think it has a little exploration element, of course. You know, I just got to the part with balloons flying across the freaking universe, garden gnoming it up. I think it's a fantastic way to spend your time. This would be a perfect uh, thing to put in mobile on. Maybe get ooh, a lot of balloons. Uh, you know, because you could just drag it across or maybe have like a thing for movement and a thing for jump. Ooh, a kite. Look at that kite. Look at that kite. It's so pink and purple. No, it's pink and white. I just lied to you. I'm sorry. Um, there's a football. Oh, there's the place I got stuck again. Let's find, let's find another balloon. Hop, hop, hop. Oh, shoot. Hop. There you go. Look at the balloon. Blowing in the wind. Let's see if we can find this over here. Hopefully, something more to burn. Oh, another house. No! Okay. I'm really bad at this game. Um, yeah. I think this game is addicting. There's a lot of potential. Add some sound, that'd be kind of cool. Add to the immersion, the whole video game thing. Um, but you know, you guys should try it yourself and support the developer. 
The link will be in the description below, as always. And consider liking and subscribing if you enjoy what you watch. And I'll always bring here, be here, to bring you the best of the indie game community. It's what I do. So thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.